Hi, I'm Nick Brandreth, the Historic Process Specialist at the George Eastman Museum. Today, we're going to show you how we make 35 millimeter film. The first thing we need to do is load some flexible film base onto our coating machine. Today, we'll be coating 5 mil acetate plastic base. Once the coating head and gelatin are warmed up, we go under red safe light to start the coating process. The first step is to draw all of the emulsion up into the steel syringe that is part of our intrusion pump. We attach a tube from the pump to the coating head and we fill the line. Once the line is filled, we switch on our intrusion pump to begin pushing the emulsion into the coating head. Once a bead is formed between the head and the film base, we switch on the roller and the machine starts to coat our film. Once the base is fully coated, we turn off the machine and we allow the film to dry. After about an hour, the dry film is ready to be sliced down to size. We will cut this film into three lengths of 35 millimeter film base. Once the film is cut down to size, we run it through our perforating machine, which punches the holes to allow the film to travel through our camera. Once the perforating is done, we load this into a reloadable film cassette and we're ready to go out and make some pictures.